Hi all. Hope you all. Hope you're keeping safe and well during this corona pandemic times. I put a few videos together, hiking and camping with my family. These bring me lots of uh, good memories. So this is a place called Flanagan Reserve in New South Wales, Australia, where where we used to go go as much as we we could, and. Uh, I used to look forward to escape from work and just to go there because I was working 60 to, 60 to 70 or 80 hours a week, which basically in a way kind of crippled me. When I look back now, sometimes I wonder how did I ever do that. It's so amazing to realize how much you can gain just by staying in nature and spending time. You could uh, stay in a city, you know, uh, watch a movie or spend some time with friends or even uh, have a barbecue in the backyard, but still, this is something totally different. You gain so much by just breathing this fresh air and staying under the trees and having a dip in a, in a creek uh, and you basically recharge your batteries so much which cannot be compared with, uh, with anything that, that you do in the city or in office. This is a place called Lala Falls in in the country town of Warburton. From memory, it's about uh, half an hour to 45 minutes hiking from the main road. The nature here is amazing. This is when we used to camp in a place uh, in the south coast of Victoria. Now I will show you the, the campsite that we used to stay. So that's the place we put up the tent and uh, just a few steps away from the beach. That's my wife enjoying a cup of tea and that's my cup of tea. And these are view that I get when I just make a 360 from where I'm standing. It's an incredibly very peaceful place. The water is coming, I'm going to move. I was quite inexperienced when I filmed this. So the camera is moving in all directions. This is also in the Flanagan Reserve, probably on another day. And uh, that's the wider section of the creek. It's like a river, really. And my son is trying to jump off the tree. Make a path here. You say we're only going to pass on us. Yeah, I am. This is exactly the line. You need to make a path. Here I'm enjoying uh, a dip in the creek. It's like as if you're in a different world. And the water is just flowing. This also in the Flanagan Reserve. Watching fire can be such a powerful thing. How the flames arise and they pass away. The reality of impermanence. This is further up the creek. 
Okay, so, so my son jumping was further down where the, the creek gets wider. It's amazing just to sit and just absorb the nature around you. This is up in, a, in the mountains and uh, it's a beautiful place in New South Wales that we should come sometimes. Watching a waterfall is kind of a, like a meditation in its own way. The freedom, the impermanence. Testing a sample of water. <laughs> The water is really so fresh. Even though the leaves have fallen and sometimes discolored, but it's coming from a really good source above. This is, uh, this is a waterfall in Thailand. When my wife and I were, what is that? we had a motorbike and we were traveling and uh, we stopped in this place where we it's about just about 200 meters you stop the bike and you can just come and see this beautiful waterfall so i think red strawberries done mm -hmm. enjoying some strawberries by the also in Warburton where we were camping in a caravan park this is not the usual kind of camping that we do mm -hmm. we love camping in the wild but sometimes when you don't have that much time you just take the opportunity mm -hmm. whatever you get so if I just have one one day off, I would just come and camp with my wife and then go back the next day to work. Of course you can carry more stuff in the car and get more prepared with the food but <laughs> have more comfort in the tent than just carrying a tent, uh, just lightweight tent and going hiking and camping. It's two different experiences, but, but I prefer just going in the wild, hiking for days and camping. Ocean Pacific, look. This is a beautiful place in Altona, close to where I live. <laughs> huh? This is just like a carpet. It's a beautiful place. This is this in the Wilson's Promontory National Park. Uh, campsite is Little Waterloo Bay, and uh, it's just about two three hundred meters from the campsite. This is also in the Wilson's Promontory just outside the lighthouse. <laughs> Amazing stones, huh? The lighthouse, you get these beautiful rocks. Wow. It's just amazing unbelievable colors and shades
You should turn around and look at that. This is also in the Wilson's Promontory. Uh, hiking from Sealess Cove to Little Waterloo Bay, you come across this place, which is just unbelievable. The views, the freedom, the beauty. Sitting at the edge of the rock. Not really at the edge, we're quite close, but. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't very experienced in no, filming no. these, so the camera is moving in all directions, and that's my backpack over there. And uh, you might even get dizzy watching this. this but I didn't want to take anything off, I'll just leave it. That's just outside the lighthouse, also in the Wilson's Promontory. Wow, it's just it's a beautiful view. The colors are just. Enough. I think the most beautiful place that I've ever camped in Australia is in the Wilson's Promontory. I hope you enjoyed the video. May you be truly happy. Take care. See you soon.